Good morning. A little chilly out there right now. As we go through the day, though, beautiful day. Again, a lot of sunshine, less wind for us today. So mostly sunny. We'll stay in the 30s as we head through 9 o'clock. And then tomorrow, or this afternoon, not tomorrow, 47 degrees at lunchtime and highs today in the mid 50s. Right now, 37 degrees. This is a, around where we started out yesterday, but we don't have the wind, so it doesn't feel as chilly this morning. And around the state, we're starting off at 25 in Raton, Farmington at 24, Alamogordo at 39, and Carlsbad starting off at 31 degrees. Another cold front heading our way that's going to bring in cooler conditions and more snow. We'll have all the details on that coming up. Well, could there be more funding for the Paseo I-25 interchange coming soon? The answer tops your morning news clips. The city might get a little help from the state rebuilding the I-25 Paseo interchange after all. Governor Susana Martinez says she's planning to ask the state to chip in $30 million for the project. The city is already putting up $50 million toward the $93 million it'll cost to get it all done. The feds have ordered Expo New Mexico and the Downs at Albuquerque to clean up lots of horse manure. The Environmental Protection Agency found that heavy rains have been washing animal waste all the way to the Rio Grande. The EPA has given the Downs and Expo 30 days to come up with a plan to fix it. Sandoval County Sheriff's deputies now say a 17-year-old driver caused a crash with a school bus after he had problems shifting and looked away from the road. Deputies say the teen and 14 elementary school students on the bus were hurt, but not badly. And the University of New Mexico men's basketball team stopped its two-game losing streak last night. The Lobos rolled over Colorado State 85-52, and that does it for your morning headlines.